Hi, my name is Thorsten Lang. I'm the founder and director of the Reiki Academy in London, Hey House author for Reiki. And today I would like to reflect on a subject that is really important for the practice of Reiki, the Reiki principles. Most of the time, people look at the content. Just for today, do not be angry, do not worry, be grateful, work with diligence and be kind to others. And we start reflecting on this, we start to try to implement that in our lives and we realize it does make a difference. But there is another element to the Reiki principles and that is kind of hidden. It refers to the energetic vibrations. Because ultimately Reiki is an energy healing system. It's a system that helps us to raise our vibrations and the Reiki principles do exactly this. Do not be angry and do not worry. Reminds us of the lowest vibrations in the universe. They keep us artificially low. They block us. They prevent us from moving on. They keep us in the past. In case of anger, we are normally angry about something that has happened. Or we project even the past into the future by worried about what may happen in the future. They don't tell us not to ever get angry. This is just a normal human emotion. They don't tell us not to ever be worried. Worry is really important because it helps us to prepare properly for the future. But they tell us don't get stuck in there. Realize when you're angry, when you're worried, it keeps you stuck in a certain place and doesn't allow you to let go, to trust and move on. The lowest vibrations in the universe. Gratitude kickstarts our vibrations. As soon as we realize there is so much we can be grateful for, whether it's a flower outside, whether it's taking a deep breath and feeling I'm alive, or of course, whether it's feeling the energy of Reiki in our hands and realizing what we are connected to. As soon as we become aware of what we can be grateful for, we raise our vibrations. Working with diligence means we are powerful. We have got so much energy. We are connected to something deeper. And once we bring these higher vibrations into our life, once we apply them diligently to every aspect of our life, we can make such a difference. And being kind to others simply reminds us of the highest vibration in the universe. Love, oneness, kindness. This is all the same. This is who we truly are. We are connected to everyone. We are not singled out. We are not just uh, reduced to what we often feel like, just being in a body and uh, struggling with life. We are connected to the entire universe. And Reiki helps us to feel this connection in our hands. Kindness means living this. So the Reiki principles really make Reiki a lifestyle. And as soon as we recite them, as Mikao Usui, the founder of Reiki, suggested every morning and every evening to sit down for a moment and just recite, just for today, do not be angry, do not worry, let go of these low vibrations. Be grateful, arrive in the present moment, work with diligence, live up to who you really are and be kind to others because you are connected to everyone, you are love. Once we recite this, when we live this, then we really live Reiki and we move away from Reiki as a complementary therapy to practicing it as our personal spiritual path. I hope you found this video inspirational and don't forget to like, subscribe and comment.